Now it has not been directly stated who or what the black monster is, but that those pictures alone had a lot of clues. Nothing has changed. Oh, I gotta remember how to do this voice again. Am I hesitating? She's silly. Okay, so we are Rose at the moment. Good to see her again. Mother, I am back. Who said that? Second Sacred Sister Wana. Mother, it's been a while since the tragic day I lost my sight. I'm able to see today thanks to the love of many people that like Seti here. May the Divine Tree bless all the victims of the tragedy. Who is it? It's not mean to surprise you. You are just a traveler. Please don't be alarmed. There are people of Neat and my mother sleeping here. Are you here to visit the grave too? I guess so. Then you know about Neat? Do we get a flash to Marina too? I'm curious what she's up to. I miss her. Nope, we get Neat 18 years ago. There's another clue! Where is Princess Lovia? I'll never tell you! Oh. I can't see. Mom, I'm scared. Okay, so she's British, good gotcha. Gotcha. We don't have a British female in that room. Oh my. Don't come. Where is Princess Lovia? Where did you hide the moon child? We don't know. What kind of spitefulness do you have towards our village? You want to die with your daughter? I don't know what I'm doing with this voice. Mom, I'm scared. Lovia, look for the sea. This must be enough to satisfy yourself. Now leave this village. The chance to eliminate the moon child comes only once every 108 years. It's the time of birth when the moon glows a blood color. The newly born moon child has a magic power. The magic power changes everyone around into an evangelist for the god. Seven to help prepare for the descending of the god. Objectors will never be satisfied. So I kill every single person who was present as the moon child passed through. Mom, um, answer me. It's it's hot. It's burning. Mom. 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 Well, I mean, we know she's okay, but you know it's. Uh... Obviously, she lost her mom. It was a miracle that I survived. I see. And your eyes were... back then. Yes, however, instead, the god imparted me with something else. Sister Juana can see people's souls. But she can feel their pain, too. So that Sister Juana has suffered. Now I, can, now I can appreciate this power that I have, because it allows me to heal the pain in people's hearts. If you need to heal the pain in your heart, 
Please tell me. I can help you. That's not necessary. By the way, are you done? Yes. I'll be... I'll be... I will go back to Dinagrad soon. May I join you? Even if you are with knights, the forest is filled with dangerous monsters. I can protect you from them. I see. Then I ask you to come with us. We go to Dinagrad then. We make sure you're safe and you not be encountered by mean things that hurt you. I just wanted to speak like that more. It's like practice. Yes! Home of Meru! So, where is her home? Some kind of cave? It's been a long time. I wonder if everyone's alright. Won't they feel lonely without me? <laughs> Such confidence. The fuck? Wow! Hey, watch out! Who is this coming through the boundary? Who are you not knowing me? Meru? Is that you, Meru? Gua... Guaraha. Guaraha? Wait, what? Long time no see. You look great. Do you think I'm really great? How could you leave without telling me? Where have you been? Huh? Hey, I came all the way back here. You don't need to yell at me. Aren't you happy to see me? I'm very happy to see you. But leaving the forest is out of is out of taboo. You left the forest, so you don't know if everyone else is the forest will forgive you, Meru. Who cares about taboos? Everybody in this forest. And the humans outside. Why is she referring to them as humans? Both of us are living in the same world. Why do we have to draw a line and lock ourselves in like this? That's what I must know. That's what I must know. I've been living in this forest forever. I wish I knew. I'm going to ask the ancestor. I won't ask you anymore. So, why is it that Meru is friends with a wingly? Has silver hair like a wingly? And has her home in a place that apparently is for winglies. Humph, humph, humph. I can only wonder why that just might damn well be. Mary's a wingly. No shit. I'm a little hyper at the moment. I'm getting hungry. But can she fly? That I don't actually remember. If she still has her wings or not. Man, she is, they are all conservative in their dressing. She is not. I'm home! Oops, it seems I'm not that welcome. It's Meru. Meru is back! This is my home. I can come home any time. Such selfishness is not tolerated. There's no place to come home to, Meru. But, that's true. Who are these people? You are the black sheep of the proud winglies. How dare you shamelessly come back? Elder Bardell. I thought you were satisfied with your decadent human life, weren't you? Bardell? What are you talking about? Go back to the humans. And wait there for the moment we destroy the humans. Pardon. Stop it. Oh, stop it. It's an old man. The ancestor. You left the forest on your own volition. Why did you come back? I just want to see everybody. Leaving the forest is an unforgivable mortal sin. Didn't you know that when you left for the world of humans? As well as that you could never come back here. Yes, I did, but it's strange. 
The world is a hundred times bigger than this forest. There are of course bad humans, but there are many good humans too. You never met them and you shouldn't hate them. There are people who hate and detest humans just because they are humans, but their number is few. We just want to protect our life. That's all. Humans have always been afraid of the magic power of Winglies. The fear eventually turns itself into a need for to tyrannize us and take some action. Either to subjugate or kill Winglies. That's why we need our own world like this forest where humans cannot enter. Did you forget that you guys like enslaved us before? Go back to the other world where existence angers the others. I understand. I'll leave. Heru! Who now? Mother! Jesus! On a stick! Leave the girl alone. Father, you must be joking. That's the rule. We are going. Bye, ma'am. It's a savage as fuck. Mother, father. It must be hard for you, but you must go back, Meru. Get out of our forest at once! Okay, Bardo, you're a dick. The 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 elder, he's cool. The ancient or whatever. He's he he's like, hey, this is why you need to go. It is silly, you're right, but this is the norm. Oh, hot damn, these people are back. What the friggle? Guara! Guara, what are you doing? They're gonna bang? Quiet! I have to talk between just the two of us. Put your wings away, they're noisy. It seems you received a horrible welcome. It's nothing to me. Stop talking through it. tough. Mary was just bad timing. Everyone's feeling tense lately. Is that my fault too? No. Recently there is the surging. Don't you feel it, Meru? I've been feeling it a little. The animals in the forest were acting savage. This must be the cause. But what is this? My sister Blano said that it is an omen of a dragon coming back to life. And it's not the usual one. Even our ancestors who had much stronger magic power couldn't defeat it. What kind of dragon is that? I know. It's the strongest dragon of all. The king of dragons with seven magical eyes. The divine dragon. <laughs> divine dragon? The ancestor says that the seal is half dissolved. That's why everybody's nervous. B but we have a dragon buster and a dragon block staff. Dragon buster? Don't we? Sword for killing dragons. The dragon buster has been lost. It, it wasn't me. I know, because it was hidden with the staff in a place that only the ancestor could open. And, and the talk you wanted between just the two of us is about the dragon? That too. What I really want to tell you is something else. Meru, don't leave me. I want you to be at my side. I can protect you if everybody opposes you. You're kind as always, but if you do, you'll be hated as well. I must go. Everybody's waiting for me. You have friends. They're great. They show me lots of things and teach me many things. Ciao. Meru. Poor guy. Raha. He just wants to love Meru.
Well, it looks like something broke free. I can only assume that's the divine dragon. There are not. I did not. I only saw one eye. But um, yeah, the Wingleys are probably shitting themselves at this point. Poor things. Is that yeah? You. What are you going to do? Are you going to pursue the man, Lloyd? When you get time, go visit Neat. You cannot change the past. However, you can face it. By facing it, maybe you can find out where you're from and where you want to go. Yes. That's it? Okay. I guess he wasn't just a snob. He's a good man. Well... You have to wait for Rose and Meru. Wait, wait. Did Dart just like pass out? Is anything wrong? D no. I just felt a little shiver, that's all. I feel something is wrong. Whatever could be wrong, you ask, I wonder. But. We will find that out in the next episode of The Legend of Dragoon. We had four frickin' cutscenes. That is so kind of the of the game designers. Um, but yeah, everyone, thank you so much for watching. I do absolutely love it when I play this game, so I need to just do it more. Also, I've decided I'm going to buy that Armor of Legend because that sounds amazeballs. So anyway, thank you so much for watching. Please like and subscribe. Share this with your friends. And... Yeah, feel free to leave a comment and, uh, you know, give me any input. Just don't do spoilers, even though I've already known to beat, I've known, I have not beat this game, but I've watched it be beaten by my brother, so I know how it ends, but if some people might not, some people might actually be watching this blind, which would be weird, considering it's so old, and they might read the comments, just don't spoil it. Just, yeah, plus I forget things, obviously. Everyone, thank you so much for watching. Take care, and bye-bye.